And then there were four. Both teams have dazzled and delighted us throughout. But who will make it to the World Cup final? Stay tuned. We're live next on EA TV. Hello and a warm welcome on what is a glorious night for football, perfect playing conditions. I'm Derek Ray and I'm joined for expert analysis by Stuart Robson. And what we have to bring you is action from the semi-final here at the 2023 World Cup. It's Spain and they take on Sweden. Well, this could be an absolute classic and the prize couldn't be any bigger, could it? A place in the World Cup final. Let's just hope we get two teams that want to play good football and come out and attack the opposition. This should be a good game. Here's the lineup for Spain. Well, it's a 4 3 3 with two out and out wingers, but they do vary their movement. They give width, but they also make diagonal runs in field when the ball's on the opposite flank. Their performances will be key today. Here's the starting 11 for Sweden. Well, in this shape, their two holding midfield players will be key today. If they can get on the ball and dictate the play, protect the two centre-backs, it will then allow the attacking players to show their creative quality. And they kick off here. Illestet. On to Jakobsson. And space to cross it. Now veering in field. But nothing comes of it. Bon Mati. Good movement. A very effective clearance. And a chance for them to nudge in front. Oh, good save. And over comes the corner. Illestet. Good pressure to win the ball back high up the pitch. Firing it towards goal. And a goal! The opener in the semi-final. First goal of the contest. Well, here it is again, and she's just been caught on the ball. That's a complete lack of awareness. It's a poor bit of play, really. Well, the ball is moving once more. How important will that opening goal prove to be? Kosovari Aslani. 
Here's Jakobsson. Looking away patiently, looking for an opening. Oh, a lovely ball. And no getting away from it. It should have been the equaliser. Well, that's a poor finish from there. She has to do better than that. Bjorn. Well, we saw what she was trying, but it didn't come off for her. Ivana. Mariona. Regained possession. And attempting the through ball. Oh, terrific pass. Can she score? And a goal! How about that? As they increase their advantage, and who's to say they won't be going to the final at this rate? Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. So back underway with the scoreline standing at 2-0. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Beautifully disguised ball. Alexia Puteas. Jenny. And scope for them to produce something exciting. It should be. And there she is. At the double, nobody can get close to her. Well, here it is again. What a good build-up this is. Quick, incisive passing, clever movement, and all done at pace, which led to a simple finish. That's a real joy to watch. without reply Rolfe on to Ericsson Anderson Elin Rubinson Rubinson on to Aslani Fridolina Rolfe Might really be able to trouble them here. But it fizzles out thanks to that piece of defending. Well, doesn't have to do it on her own. Defensive roadblock in the way of that cross. Really a very poor ball. Sofia Jakobsson. And striking the post. Offside the verdict, however, so no drama. Well, let's take another look. And there it is, just offside. Mind you, it was very close, wasn't it? Plenty of support here. Opportunity! That is a tackle and a half. They're really pressing their opponents. Anderson. 
moving forward effectively great block well just one minute of time added on for stoppages here Jenny Alba Redondo now with Abellera well, the managers will now deliver their half-time team talks. We're at the end of 45 minutes in this game. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how this second half pans out. Bjorn. She's made a really important challenge. Abellera getting in there to intercept surely a goal and I'll tell you what on this sort of form very few would lay a glove on them Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, and then the finish is fairly simple in the end. That's a good goal. And this is turning into something of a rout. 4-0. Elin Rubinson. Here's Jakobsson. Makes the move to the inside. And a goal it is! Just what she was hoping to contribute. Well, just look at the defending here. They just don't read the danger. It's a poor goal to concede. and plentiful supply 4-1 currently Jakobsson good looking sequence but they took care of the situation defensively Redondo Ona Batye Jenny Important interception. Ball's gone. Well, showing everyone her abilities in possession.
The referee's letting it go as they keep the ball. Jenny. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Carolina Sega. Can they do something positive on the counter-attack? A really sumptuous ball. Well, a badly timed run, just a fraction offside. Well, here it is again, and yes, it's close, but it is offside. Great decision by the assistant. Well, they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. And they have possession again. Illestet. Sega. Jakobsson. Just the challenge that was required. Olga Carmona. Good looking ball. There could be a chance now. And she's being egged on by the crowd. Another goal! The lead grows to four now. A rampant display. Well, here it is again. It's a wonderfully weighted ball over the top. And the finish is really good. She just smashes that past the keeper. That's a top quality goal. to conclude that this hasn't really been a contest but all credit to any side committed to scoring goals like this Illestet and out of play the pass nearly worked out but not quite substitution then let's see how it affects the match Just 10 minutes to go. Beautifully disguised ball. Not to be this time. Teammates available. This looks more than decent. The high press was on and that's a fantastic tackle. Stina Blackstenius. Not much defensive cover there on the flank. And the cross not quite accurate enough. Mariona. Well, we are going to have a decent amount of stoppage time. Three minutes to be exact. Sornosa. Putellas. And the counter-attack is on. Options available. There's the whistle. Spain will be taking part in the World Cup final. Well, it was such a dominant performance from start to finish. They dictated the tempo for large parts of the game and were absolutely lethal in front of goal. After a performance like that, they have to be favourites going into that final now. Surely it's theirs to lose.